Today's video is brought to you by a very special human being. We decided to start giving major shout outs to the people who are paying for these meals. And our buddy, Kurt Cooper, who's donating $50 a month. Did you give Helen the $50? What $50? On Patreon. What? So it's basically paying for like a whole month's worth of these brewing reviews. We want to do a little shout out and say thank you for paying specifically for this meal, my friend. This video is for you. And all of you. can look anywhere Wherefore I want because, because I got sunglasses on. You can't see my eyes. My eyes! Welcome to Bruin Review. When I'm on the internet, I'm watching Bruin Review. Corey, what are we drinking today? Today we're drinking from one of my favorite breweries in all the land, 21st Amendment. Their tasty IPA. And who's our friend on the can? That's a half-naked Benjamin Franklin, and boy is he getting my rocks rolling. Oh my god. Didn't Ben Franklin have syphilis? <laughs> yes, but I don't. <laughs> He's got um, hops on his He's nipples. got hops on his nipple, haps, hops on his nipples. 6.8%, 70 IBUs on the bitterness scale. So IBUs. This is a seasonal release, so because it is winter, we're drinking IPAs. <laughs> that doesn't seem right. Merry winter. Mm. And today we have a pizza by Bart Simpson's demonic brother. <laughs> you can stop looking at me now. This is Wild Mike. Okay, Wild Mike's. We saw this at Jewel Osco, laughed. What choice do we have but to get it? And then put other things back to get it. Yeah, right. Like, because nah. you don't see. For also, this is humongous. Wild this Mike! This is a massive box. You ever had a nightmare on a pizza box before? Ultimate pizza. Ah! Over two pounds, super sized combination. Listen to this, Corey. Sausage and uncured pepperoni pizza. No nitrates except those naturally occurring in celery powder and sea salt. That's too many words to be on a frozen pizza. That's a dream of a pizza and a nightmare of a spokesman. Also, do all, I have to quit my job to read all this? Did you hear my way funnier bit? <laughs> <laughs> Wild Mike, send us one of these shirts, bro. I want yeah, one of Yeah, after shirts just decimating his branding, I'm no, sure. No, I love it. I love Nightmare. You're holding the one and only Wild Mike's ultimate pizza. And if you've had one before, you know to hold on with both hands because it's Wow! Wild Mike's the perfect addition to a day of extreme sports or even extreme lounging in front of the TV! Now you can share the love of Wild Mike's pizza with the world, introducing Wild Mike's official apparel! And then they have an order form. <laughs> this is the Nickelodeon. This is the GoPro of pizza. Karma! Oh, almost lean back on this little beast. Oh yeah, there's like a little Careful hamster. Buddy. There's a little hamster back here. Careful, buddy. Anywho, I'm hungry. So we're gonna dive right in to Wild Mike's. Happy Bruin Review, happy Friday. Hope you're still employed. This is Wild Mike's Pepperoni and Sausage Pizza in our town from Jewel Osco. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah, wow, this is, okay. Their big thing is like, it's all real ingredients too. As I suspected, mm -hmm. the ingredients taste that of which high school cafeteria pizza. The sauce, the cheese, the meat, that's what it tastes like to me. It tastes like it's on better crust. Yeah. But here's a little curveball for you. Guess what? I like cafeteria pizza. I did too. So this is still, this is pretty good to me. It's not bad at all. I like it. I think we got it for six bucks too. Yeah. It's not something that's like changing the game in frozen pizza. It's just a good quality frozen pizza. Mm -hmm. And the fact that all of their branding, all of their verbiage talks about how four cheeses flown in from Italy, no artificial flavoring, no stuff that's like swamped with chemicals and stuff like that, which a lot of frozen pizzas are. So that's nice. I think the crust is the highest. Highlight, a good crunch. It is a pretty good crust. I like the, the whole crust, not just like the crust, like the right, whole crust. Right, which is difficult to come by, I think, in the, or somewhat difficult to come by in the frozen food section. It is. This is real, really good sauce. Very salty. Maybe that's why I like it. Pepperoni and the sausage are spawns of sodium mm -hmm. themselves. Mm -hmm. This is a quality. Wild Mike's, nice job. The, what, I don't know what, how wild you are, but <laughs> we're pretty tame, but it's good. Bro, I hope you bite into one of these and it's just got like razor a, blade. I think it's, I'm just always expecting. I was gonna say a quarter, like a, <laughs> oh yeah, maybe in a, a Pennsylvania quarter. Remember they used to have whole, uh, you know different states. They still have that. So I hope you just chew in and he's like, how about that for some wild? You know, something <laughs> like that. Is Pennsylvania the wildest state you can think of? You know, Michael, I fathered an illegitimate son. 
Really? <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> Before all you monsters start roasting me about not giving no pepperonis to this nice little beast over here, I want you to know he's got a little bit of a condition and he's not allowed to eat adult food anymore. He's got a bad ticker and his lungs fill up with liquid. Sometimes. Isn't that dog like 49 years old? He's, very, he's ancient. But ancient? We, we gotta keep he's on a strict diet. So nobody tell me I'm a bad person for not giving him no pets. Also, I don't even think humans should eat this. Welcome to Sean and Irwin's Pizza Corner. I'm Sean. And this is Corey's crotch. <laughs> got a couple of packets. This is this might even be the best part about these guys. So yeah, we come with a couple about wild Mike's packets. One is Italian spice, the other is red pepper, crushed red peps. I want to try the Italian spice. This is like a dog that if he is sitting on your lap, I feel like a demonic like villain. <laughs> yes, yeah, yeah. cast the bombs now. <laughs> <laughs> Let this be a reminder to you all that this organization will not tolerate failure. Oh! All right, one last little couple of bites with the seasoning packets seasoning. from uh, Wild oh, Mike's. Bro. Next level. Mike's wild, dude. Italian seasoning and red pepper. Cheers. You that Italian seasoning is really good. Mm. There's something that frozen pizza companies don't do. They mm -mm. don't give you packets with it. No, this is super awesome. You gonna make it, little man? Yeah, dude. It's not anything amazing looking, but it, the taste is really good. Everyone needs to thank freaking Kirk for buying this for us because Thanks, this is an excellent, excellent item. I think that just upgraded that to one of the best frozen pizzas I've ever had in my life. That's legit, bro. Sure. Oh! Oh! oh. Duh! Absolutely. Duh! Duh! Absolutely. I love that we didn't know this existed. We put other pizza back. It's got the creepiest mascot of all time. Nightmare, and it's this nightmare, good. Nightmare. Over two pounds of combination. Bro, I think Wild Mike's just doing meth and making pizzas all day, bro. They also had a, just a cheese one. So if you're down for just cheese, they had that. Go get it. It was at Jewel Osco. We had a couple of these off camera. I did while we were filming B-roll for some stuff. I am a big fan of this, dude. Really good hops, crisp, but it is dank, as they say. And it's like dank. I don't think Irwin believes you. He had to walk he away. He left. <laughs> so beer's good, pizza's good, great Friday. I hope you guys have the best start to your weekend. After this, I we're hope gonna you open. wake up like Ben Franklin on this can with just shirtless with hops covering your nips. That is not the real Ben Franklin. I am 99% sure. We're gonna open up some packages after Ooh. this. For now, this if you're not into that, we don't wanna see fans <clears throat> sending us stuff Sure! Me and Ben Franklin will have a drag. We've got the good. Fan submitted packages. Jaws of life. Yeah! 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 There you go. Mmm. Peace be with you. Okay. Hey, Sean and Corey, I know you like hot sauce and I know you like beer. This is the best of both worlds and I really hope you enjoy these. From the awesome G off. Pronounced Jeff. Jeff, you are the gosh darn man. Beer infused, a hot sizzle. Oh my God. You want those bottles? Yeah. Mm. Asian Sriracha, Garlic Serrano, Roasty Chipotle, Swag, Swag, Swag Brewery. Swag. Jeff, thank you so much for sending these. Swag. These will be in a future Monday video. Ain't no doubt about it. Alpine Chocolate House, which is German. German for, German for four. Watch your bows. What is that? Man, they just keep sending me hot. Something for you. Have had this several times and I think you guys will really enjoy it. Looking forward to the Taco Bell rematch challenge in 2020. Chris and Eric are both Patreon patrons of Number Six with Cheese. That's awesome. And they're here in Chicago from Detroit because they challenged us to a mukbang. Chris Michella. Oh, Michella. M Mitchell. Uh, Chris, thank you so much. This is Bruce's Gourmet Ghost Pepper Caramel Corn. What a gas darn Christmas. Chris, we love you so much. Eric, Chris Haynes, you, the whole, the whole Gale crew. Uh, if you guys want to send us stuff to our UPS store, uh, that is the address to do right so. There. We open it on camera. We enjoy our favorite things on camera. But until then, you heard it before. Start the week off right. You don't got to get up on, early on Saturday, so keep going. Sure, I'll have a drink.